very open and very honest. Absolutely, yeah. What are the lessons that you learned? The, the truth doesn't hurt. Whatever it is, it doesn't really? hurt. It's, it's better to know the truth. I remember, um, my mum only lied to me about one thing. Um, she, uh, she said there was a God. And, um... <laughs> But that's because when you're a working class mum, Jesus is like an unpaid babysitter. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? It's just sort of like, she wants you to be good. You know, the best of working class mum where I grew up could, she, she wasn't hoping I'd be a doctor or a lawyer. She hoped I wouldn't be stabbed to death in a barroom fight, you know. So, the best thing to do is, well, if, he, if he's God-fearing, then he'd be good. It's a good rule of thumb because, you know, I went to Sunday school from about the age of four till eight. There was just great teachings of Jesus. I love Jesus. He was my superhero. Um, he really was. God was magic, right? But Jesus was just a man. And what I loved about Jesus was he was kind. And he, he was brave, and I thought he was amazing. And um, I absolutely I thought he was brilliant, right? just a brilliant guy, you know. So I was about eight, and my brother must have been 19. He came in once, and uh, I was doing uh, something from the Bible. And I said, what are you doing? I said, oh, join Jesus. And he went, um, <laughs> who was Jesus? I said, well, he was, he was the son of God. He went, why do you believe in God? Right? And my mum went, Bob, shut up. <laughs> And I knew she had something to hide, <laughs> and he was telling the truth. And I knew, I knew from body language. And then I worked it out, and I was an atheist in an hour. In an hour? Yeah. <laughs> it's true. I wish there was a God. I wish there was. It would be great. What I've heard, he's brilliant, you know. <laughs> but, um, I just, I can't, you can't, you can't believe in something you don't. Also, if there is a God, why did he make me an atheist? <laughs> that was his first mistake. <laughs> well, the talking snake was his first mistake, but...